Hi, it's Bags here. We are looking at the brand new Barker. All right, uh, we've seen Barker in some of the cutscenes in the past. I think there may even be a three-star card for him. And you'll have seen the three-star weapon Barker's rifle, Barker's assault rifle. Now, this is a brand new character. You've seen it from Barker's story. There was a really much weaker version available in the first act and then a full-powered version available in the second act. So Scopely's given us a chance to take him for a spin, see what he can do. Now they want to try and sell him to us, or sell a chance of getting him anyway. Um, he is a pretty damn dope-looking card. Look at that there. In fact, I'm going to say that is some pretty sick art. Now, he's busting du double sickles, which I'm not really sure if they are the most functional weapon. However, that's what he's rocking. Let's have a look at him before we do a open. Here we go. Let's look at him. Barker, he comes with above average HP and attack and around normal defense. His rush, however, is the same ballpark as five Stark body armor Jesus. However, it's just two enemies instead of all adjacent. Now, if there's a human shielder on the board, that's one less person getting hit by that damage. So that's quite a significant drop. However, that character is going to be not necessarily an adjacent one. It could be one on the other end of the group. So that can be a way to reach uh, pesky blues that have human shield protection. Now, looking at his rush, massive damage and minus 20 AP to two enemies. So if you do, if you are hitting a Lee and you're afraid of aggroing him, this is one way to prevent that from happening. On top of that, he comes with neutralize, which is, as we're starting to discover, an incredibly powerful skill. One of the top leader skill, uh, one of the top specialist skills with human shield and um, and uh, look, killing blow uh, executioner is also very good as well. Tenacity, so neutralizes right up there. Can be super effective, especially once you crack through that enemy human shield. It's going to give you the potential to just lock down enemy troops so that they cannot hit you with their rushes. Now, he also comes with a his very own weapon, and it's allocated just to him. And with the new update. Special weapons allocated to individual cards can be modified. So this card, just like Shiva, his weapons can be modified. You want to keep that medium bonus, so he's ticking over in turn three in attack. Now, in defense, you can have him going off turn two in defense if he has a leader with a very large bonus to AP when attacking. So that could be Angela, for example. Um, or you could modify his weapon to give him a very large bonus to AP when attacking, and he could have a medium bonus leader, like Ben or Victor. So this is an incredibly effective card. Splash damage, look, I don't really like that. It's uh, it's very similar to the collateral damage uh, specialist skill, which I don't rate at all. So I would be removing that most likely, overriding it with a different special. I think that the uh, chance of doing zero damage uh, is a really effective one. Even the bleed damage one could be better. Or how about just something to make him live a little longer, like a HP or defense bonus. I think that would be really great because this guy already has enough tricks up his sleeve with his rush and his specialist skill. You could stack, stack onto that with the cool weapon, but the need isn't really there because he's already bringing a lot to the table. So why don't we bring, or why don't we bust out a single open for Mr. Barker Boy. All right, let's crack it open now. We're going to open it on. Mm -hmm. Oh, how about this awesome Abe? He was just up for grabs in the recent solo level up tourney, and congrats to the winner in our region. I think he scored around 2.2 million points. Well done. Here we go. Let's open him up. Three, two, one. What are we going to get? We're going to get something. Mm, is it Barker? It is the Shane Train. Oh, and that's filled in half of my protect and serve little um, little challenge there. So we've got the Shane. We'll complete that challenge and then we'll sell him. I'm not complaining too much. I mean, I got Magna on a single pull the other day, so I don't really. Uh, and if you want to watch that video, just, just check on through. 
um, check in my in my previous video. So there we go. That is Shane. Let's have a look at Shane. If you're a new player, look, I'm in Shane. Does a lot of damage for his rush for a three star card. Three fifty percent damage. It's most three stars do not have a rush that does that much damage. He um, and he comes with a decent um, leader skill for a three star. And when you're rocking just a three star team, it can. This sort of card can really boost your team as a single hitter with his really quick AP. Rush, you know, I could see use for him from bags like a year ago, but not today, unfortunately. So we're going to keep him until the challenge is completed, then sell him off as usual. Excellent. All right, well, look, while we're here, why don't we do some other opens? So we're going to head on over to, what do we got here? We've got, oh, excellent, two Elite item opens. Let's do that now. What do we got? Hannah and an Alpenstock. Sure, I'll take that. And I need those Hunter Trainers for my Alicia and for my Magna. So fantastic. Fantastic. All right, now let's also have a look. We have a four-star weapon to open up now. Let's crack it open. And what do we got? Governor's Rifle. Is that... I've never seen that weapon before. Okay. I have... Yeah, I've never, never, ever seen that weapon before. There's like a governor's revolver. I mean, it's a one of those all-comers weapons. It's got a bit of everything, so it's not a keeper. But yeah, I've... Wow, okay. I've never, ever seen that weapon before. Wow, Okay. That is, there you go. Something new every day, guys. Is there anything else for me to open? There's going to be a five-star recruit pretty soon, but no more today. Well, that is all for now. That was a pretty interesting little open. Bag out.